Eman here, what's up guys? We're back with another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. In the last one, we attended a couple of classes. Uh, we learned Alohomora from the caretaker. I can't remember his name. Uh, we got that by like uh, finding some of those little statues that we didn't know what to do with before. They're called Demi guys. And we also went to, I believe, uh, to care for magical creatures class. And uh, after class, we met a hippogriff. Now we're going to do the Herbology class so we can learn with Guardian Leviosa. And then after that, uh, we'll continue with the main quest. Um, this probably shouldn't take too long, so let's just get right into it. Oh, Miss Garlic. She's my favorite teacher so far. I really like plants. I can't remember most of the other students' names, though. Oh, uh, I knew, like, Sebastian. How but, wonderful to see you again. Hmm. Where are you? Hey, where is she? It was wonderful seeing you, too. Oh, there you are. I finished the assignments, ma'am. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pains to hear it. Professor Weasley will be, too. I'm sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Oh, okay. Guardian Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. I was wondering why I was called something else, but I guess it's just folders, as though they were sprigs of two different spells. But this will let me pick up heavier things, I guess. There's a couple of Merlin trials that I think probably require this because there's like nothing that I can do with them so far. Maybe, oh, so. I don't know, levitation charm, but I'm going to move on to this control position with the movement I use. So I'm going to levitation. Okay. Well done! Feel free to practice when guarding your lovely ears that here in the greenhouse. Wait, what? Oh, is it not a spell? It's just one of those automatic things, I guess. Um, Stupefy, Protego, Rebellio, it's just basic. Uh, okay. <coughs> hmm. Am I just blind? Because I don't see even Guardian Leviosa anyway. Right, it's out for you in the next room. Um, what is this? I'm done. Is this still just with the same? Oh. Okay. I don't know why, I thought it was going to be yellow. Okay, I am blind. Wait, what? I thought I was supposed to be able to do something with it though. Oh, okay, then I can just move it to wherever I want it to go. Okay. Alright. Sounds simple enough. Um, <coughs> I'll probably want to keep that thing up, though. Um. Yeah, it should be fine. Okay, now we're gonna go to uh, what's the next? I'm sure that I can do something here. Talk to her, maybe? Professor Garlic, <coughs> a moment of your time. The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. I was wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask! I've always had an affinity for green, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. A oh dear. Is tentacle. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Hmm. Well, he never cared, really cared for the plants, and they could sense it. You'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be. At any rate, the trouble began one day when he cut into a wagon tree. 
Unfortunately for him, it's fees for hiding a bone truckle. You may recall the marvelous creatures that resemble a twig. The little beast gouged the professor's oh. eyes quite fiercely, but terrifying, I imagine. <coughs> uh, likely for the professor, too. And that's when you took over as the herbology professor. Jesus Christ. Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for him. <laughs> I mean, it's almost funny. <laughs> Fair bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well, I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge Bro. from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. Can't he really blame him, though. The patients he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacular, and, well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. <laughs> I'm glad everything worked out as it did, and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your wicked trees. Of course. Hmm. I wonder, was that all that I could do? It's showing something there. Now um, look at the quest. Um okay, I need three more to upgrade on one more. <coughs> I guess I could do this one. Let me see where it's at. And then we can go um continue the quest. Oh. Never mind, maybe not. Oh, no. Oh. A bit far, but yeah, sure. Let's go. We'll just go do that, and then we'll continue right back with the with the main quest. I believe in Hogsmeade. Where are you? What is it? What's wrong? Goblins. That's what. Rat <coughs> on lot. Nasty creatures. Ambush me, did it? Nothing safe anymore. I need little something, something to protect me if I run into them again. Maxima potion. That would do it. I don't think I have any. I don't have any of that. Perhaps you could try and Hogsmeade, or one of the hammers. And get extorted by the Ashwinders? No, thank you. Uh, if you won't help me, I shall have to take my chances, mm -hmm. won't I? I'll buy a couple of more stuff for the one requirement. So I think I should be able to make more <coughs> <coughs> uh, potions and grow more plants. Oh, we can just fly. I'll just go do that real quick. And then... Rebellion. A lot of stuff over here. Then once we've done this, uh, we can go to Hogsmeade. Here we are. Oh, Mr. Weeks wasn't wrong about the mountain views. If it isn't the second best Slytherin. <laughs> second best? You wish. Alright, so we're just gonna destroy her real quick because she's, uh. It's kind of annoying. Hello, Mara. <coughs> so, another trial? Of course it's another trial. And you'd better be taking part. So what? You finally scared everyone else away? Oh, I have plenty of challengers. They're just not very good. No one sets records by wishing for them. And I need strong competition to stay on top of my game. Are you going to try to beat my flying record or not? Yes, I'll destroy you. I'm ready to fly. Finally. A the first challenge. one was pretty easy. Uh, I don't know how more difficult they're gonna get. Okay, I need to get ahead of the thing. Read it. Oh no 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 no. Crap. 
I'm pretty sure it's gonna count against me too. I'm um, missing the rings. So. Oh god! <laughs> it's way faster than it was before. Ah, where are we going? Bro, okay, yeah, no. Oh, this is definitely harder. Or maybe it's just I haven't played in a while. I'm not used to it. Um, but I feel like I'm missing a lot of these things. So that's kind of counting against my score. Excellent. No. I'm becoming quite a bit. Okay, okay, okay. It's gonna start doing better. It's, it's it, it's it, it's it. It's fine, it's fine. Okay. Yeah, I think maybe I was just out of practice. I feel like it's getting a bit easier now. is if I miss like an actual ring, not not the little yellow circle, so it's fine. We did it, yes. Whew. <coughs> yeah, eat shit. You've improved, I must admit. That was a bloody good run. Be careful. Earn a reputation for talent around here, and some people get put out about it. Sounds because like your attitude, bro. Experience. Yes, well, I am. Anyway, you didn't do abysmally, I can't deny that, but you'll not have the same luck on the South Coast course. Mm, we'll see. You won't we? Till next time. I half expected you to back down. Rest on your laurels. See you at the South Coast trial, if you don't lose your nerve. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's going to be too far though, so... Let's... To race this course again, visit the podium with the leaderboard. Where you can start the race and yeah, check it's the time. Fine. We did good. Alright, now we're gonna continue with the main quest again. Uh, and I think these, like the race, um, the broom race things, um, get us upgrades for our uh, broom. So, oh, I'm done. So, yeah, I'm guessing later we'll get a mail or something from the guy at the broom place. I forget his name. Uh, I forgot what it's going to be, is Yeah, Mr. Woods, I believe is his name. <coughs> Unless I can go talk to him right now. But I believe last time I had to wait until he, um, sent me an owl. So that I can get the upgrade. So I'm sure that's what it's going to be. Now let's just continue with the story. I forgot what we're doing here. Serona, three broomsticks. Hello there, nice to see you. Oh yeah, this person. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Liquid and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lord God. He's a friend. Sure. It seemed as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now? We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. 
took them a second to realise I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Oh, okay. Goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's what been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him. About Ranrock in particular. Yeah, that's what I was Where thinking. I just didn't want to like, say I'm it in case I'm wrong. Well. to do with the rumours I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. Can't you, like, and magically you change your voice or something? You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Mm. Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. Yeah, but just working out the open. The open is rare enough. But between Isn't those weird. two, they each have no something the other has. I can guarantee it. And that's it. I fear they're like a two-headed serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. And it should be Thank you, If you find Lord Gog, please give him my best. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. Sure thing, sir, madam, person. Um... She did, did she? Did she send you with news? No, actually, I wanted to speak with you. It's about Ranrock. Now I remember. The three broomsticks. Day of the troll attack. You're the student he's after. I am. And I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to. So I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Uh, I mean, uh, I guess. Serona trusts me, and she said she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona trusts you, very well. I may know but why something she trust that could help us, us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Okay. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Hmm. If I retrieve the relic, how do I know you'll tell me the truth about what Ranrock says? We will have to trust each other. I, that you will not abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever supplies you may need, and meet me near the witch's tomb. I don't know who to trust in this game. Everybody seems shady. What damn it, guys, bro? I don't see anything. I need some. I need at least three more so that I can upgrade. Oh! It's right here. I'm blind. Oh, it doesn't shine. Like with the rebellion. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna have to wait till night time. But we can just advance the time. How would you like to learn the knockback jigs flip 
Once you've completed the necessary tasks, come and find me in the greenhouse. Greenhouse. Yes, ma'am. We'll go do that right after we're done here. Okay, then I guess now I should probably switch back to daytime. Well, I guess it doesn't matter, maybe. We'll see. If we can do this at night, cool. If not, we'll switch to daytime. Sucks about <coughs> yeah, about um being hot to me is that I can't fly in here. Like I can use my broom, which is a bit annoying. Mm. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Okay. Oh, I thought it was gonna be like out in the wilderness or something, but it's right here. I'm ready. Good. There's no time to lose. Let's go. What precisely is the relic I'm to retrieve? A valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Erdgott. Erdgott. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a trinket. She cared not what pain she caused the goblins. Goblins believe that the rightful owner of any object is its maker, not its purchaser. Wizard kind sees things differently. It's a wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. They seem to be. It may surprise you to know that I do not believe those differences always to be insurmountable. Is the reason I find myself traveling with you to this tomb today. Hmm. I'll come back into the murder trial later. Ah, and there it is, the witch's tomb. Ah, oh, dreadful looking place, isn't it? Off on another adventure, are we? I oh. wish you luck retrieving the helmet. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now, before you set off, do you have any questions? Oh, it seems Ranrock and Rookwood are conspiring. Why would that be? I had heard this. When the dark-hearted conspire, they seldom make their full intentions clear to one another. I can only speculate, but I imagine their alliance is uneasy and quite fragile. Yeah, Let us hope that ours is less so. Mm. It all okay. seems clear to me that you're <coughs> here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. Okay, so you mentioned something about having a wand to help out. And like, that's what I thought. I thought you needed a wand in order to use magic, but that one girl, uh, Natty or whatever her name is, said that in her country they don't use wands. So I'm wondering what the hell's going on there. couldn't use magic because they weren't allowed to have wands. But he can somehow use magic? How come the others can't? This can't be the witch's tomb. Like the only to go further. And I still think that that um 
thing about in Natty's country not needing walk camp afterwards, huh? To use wants to use magic is dumb, but doesn't make sense. Spell, so sometimes you have to like think Lumos. about what exactly helps in each situation. Um. <coughs> hmm, been coughing a lot lately. Hopefully, it's not the unmentionable thing. Then, uh, I have a feeling I'm not alone here. Oh, oh, oh. crap, crap. Okay, it's fine. I don't want to use these potions a lot. Like maybe I should start healing more during battle. But I've always been that person that never uses items. Because <laughs> I'm saving them for later. And then at the end, I'll finish the game and I'll still have a bunch because I was always saving them and I never use them. So I think I should start healing during battle. It makes no sense to just hold them. I'm supposed to get up there, right? To get that thing. Um, something about rotating this. But. Oh, I'm dumb. I am so dumb. Can I just get one back from the door? Oh, okay. I thought once they were on the door, they were there permanently, but okay. Wait, there's two on here. Why can't I just grab both of them and put them on the door? Hmm. No. Okay. Ah, 
I get it now. I was telling him. But again, there's two right there. You can clearly see them. I guess I will. doing <coughs> um, a couple little side quests again like nothing big it's all small crap but they'll give you like a tiny little bit of uh, experience so I've been leveling up a bit without meaning to um, see and then uh, it makes it to where when I get to these parts of the main quest, I guess I'm supposed to be doing it at a lower level, so make it a bit easier, which is not ideal. What? No! Okay, you're too slow! Okay, 
Bro, are you serious right now? This looks even more complex. Okay, so I'm supposed to come up here. Move. Oh, okay, I'm done. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Okay, I'm done, I'm done. Uh, I think I see what I need to do. But if I use a spell here... Like it just goes back. <coughs> um... Hmm. Am I just dumb and missing something super obvious here? Okay, maybe I need to go that way and okay, sure. Let's let's try something. Maybe something this way will open up a different path. The which one the <laughs> one Ah! Okay, so I need to leave that one. But then how am I gonna get this? That's what it's for, okay. Ah, okay, okay, okay. It's fine, it's fine. I'm just gonna play my sleep deprivation on this. I'm sorry, what? Yeah. 
wife was finally fight. resting place. Lord Gok said the helmet was in her sarcophagus. I don't have to fight here, right? There's no way I don't have to fight. The dead Ashwinder. The Patriots must have made up with the helmet. Lord Gok won't like this. Hmm. Okay. Better show this to Lord Gok. Oh, I really thought I was going to get an ambush here. <coughs> Alright. Hmm. I know there's a mechanism to open this door. Well, that was easy. So how come that guy died there? Hmm. Where's he at? Oh. Up, dude. Lovecock, the sarcophagus has been raided. I found no helmet, only a dead Ashwinder. Damn, they got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. I saw one of their campsites mm. not far from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. Yeah, that's fine. I'll head there now. Good. There's no time to lose. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. Sure. To think those wretched thieves have their hands on such a relic. Uh, but, uh, no, why? Well, okay. I need to change that to something that I don't. I mean, I don't have any of that now, I guess. What is this? Sure. Well, that was done. <coughs> Alright, um... This way? Okay, we can just fast travel there, and then we can fly the rest of the way. Oh, we're looking for Ben Force. Travel broadens the mind. Chest, but oh, did 
Then they're gonna glitch out because I didn't technically kill them. No, no, There it is. That's it. This is for Rookwood. Oh, what's the light go out of your eye? That's pretty good. You're not the one I go, didn't you? You're about to. You're the one who uses the novice luck. Easy. No deal to leave I defeated an Ashwinder by myself. Pretty sure we've beaten a bunch of them. Um Okay. Guess we'll just go back to Modcock. Give him the helmet. Um, I don't really know what's next after this. What to do? I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done. This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. <laughs> It just looks like a helmet to me. Nah, you're looking at what it is, rather than what it means. To most goblins, this is more than a mere helmet. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Well, no, then I kill I'm glad to get rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me, Brent. See, like, I don't trust this I'm dude. Glad, like, I like what are you? Why aren't you telling me, bro? We should speak soon. Best thing to our arrangement quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aim is crap. What should we do about the helmet thieves? I'm I afraid there's them. no choice but to stop them. Go to their camp and feel them did. at once. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, <laughs> or we will lose our chance at <laughs> I guess I wasn't supposed to speak to him. He was about to leave. Okay, whatever. It's done anyway. So. Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks when you can. I'd like your help with something. Oh, uh, sure, dude. The elf, the knapsack, and the loom. Professor Garlic's. Conjuration spellcraft. Fieldcraft. <coughs> Uh, I feel like this is a good place to end this As episode. As I mentioned, oh. my sister around Mrs. Hogwarts. She hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her. I'm sure. heading to Felcroft soon, so I'll look forward to seeing you there. It's just south of Hogwarts. By the way, hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. I need to learn a stronger language. Now that you've attended this class, I've asked. Deke to assist you in using the room to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. I've not heard from my uncle Robert Bruh. for quite some time. I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the corner? Okay, so we're gonna have a lot of stuff to do in the next one. 
Good. Is that it? Ooh, okay. All right, so uh, we're probably going to end it there for this episode. Uh, I feel like this was a decently big quest. Uh, we're near the hour mark anyway. So it was... We didn't do like a whole lot, but we did advance the plot a little bit. Uh, we got this helmet. I still don't trust this guy. Like, I don't know. He seems shady. There's something he's not telling us. Uh, I don't know if I trust Serena either, honestly. But I guess I'm going to go talk to them next episode. Uh, I might do the classes first, though. Like, I have a class Professor Garlic to learn a new spell. And I might do one of the other ones, too. I don't know if I should leave all of them for the next episode or if I should just do some of the like minor ones off off stream off off stream. Off <laughs> uh, like when I'm not recording. Uh, but yeah, that's that's it for this one. So I guess I'll just see you guys in the next one. We'll just continue right where we left off. Later.